everybody, it's Donna with Donna Steals and DIYs, and today is What's the Word Wacky Wednesday with Miss Angela. This is the first time I've been able to participate, and I'm hoping to do it next Wednesday as well before school starts back. Um, hi, Angela. I wanted to support her channel. Uh, she's so sweet and so supportive of my channel. I will link her channel below. Please go subscribe to her channel and give her lots of love. I'd appreciate it. Okay, so I didn't want to blink my lights with my wackiness today because some people don't like wacky, uh, flashing lights. And I tried to move the camera back a little bit so that y'all could see uh, the headband. I'm in front of my fireplace again. I have my little Christmas shirt on. It's just a Christmas tree with lots of little Christmas goodies on it. And um, I have a Timu haul for you today. This is a non-sponsored Timu haul. And it is not very big. It has some Christmas gifts and things in it. Um, and so I'm gonna show this to you. And so let's get started. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. I appreciate it so much. We're trying to get to a thousand subscribers before the end of the year. And I love you and I so much appreciate your support and for you subscribing, I appreciate it. It is free to subscribe. Um, so please subscribe. And, uh, Let's get started with this haul. There was something else I was gonna say and I can't remember what it was. So maybe I'll think of it before the end of this video. The first thing I wanted to show you, this is a Christmas gift for my pastor. He has a t-shirt that says this. And I asked him, do you have a cap? Because he wears caps all the time. I have a really young pastor. And he said no, and he likes black. And so this is kind of a, a real muted black. But it says, Pastor Warning, anything you say or do could be used in a sermon. And he has a t-shirt that matches it, and I wanted him to have a cap. So I bought this for his Christmas gift. And uh, on Timu, and I will uh, overlay the price that I paid for it. If you, uh, I am a Timu influencer, and I do have a code and I will overlay the code. If you've never, even though this is not sponsored, if you've never uh, ordered from Timu before, you get a discount if you use my code. I'll stick it up here just in case you've never ordered from Timu. You have to order on their app to get the discount code. All right, I'm trying to get everything out of this bag so I can show y'all what I purchased. I purchased something for my pastor's wife, our co-pastor as well for Christmas. I normally just make them cookies, but I want to do something different this year. So this, I've tried to find a frame big enough to put it in. Uh, and so hopefully I can find one. If not, maybe she can. Uh, it's a little mat. And I thought maybe it had a backing to it when I bought it, but it doesn't. It, but it did come in this really nice rolled up thing. So Timmy did a great job of sending it and then it had plastic over it. So it came like this with plastic over it. Um, but anyway, so it's a matte uh, picture, and I'm hoping to get her a frame to put it in. It says, it takes a special person to be a pastor's wife, for it is not an easy task or simple way of life. She is always there to encourage and lend a helping hand. A virtuous woman she is with wisdom and strength she stands. Devoted to God's calling as she allows him to lead. She abounds with grace, never endings. A blessing she is indeed. And so I got that for her. And like I said, I need to find a frame to put it in. I looked at the Dollar Tree and didn't find any that I thought it would fit. It's like eight by 14. So let me just give it to her like this and tell her she can uh, find a frame or we can find a frame for her later. I'm still looking for a frame. So uh, hopefully we'll find one before I give it to her this Sunday. Now I bought a package of, and I overlay the price there for that. I bought a package of five of these lotions and I overlay the price. These lotions, um, I gave two away for Christmas gifts already to teachers because, you know, school's out for Christmas and it's out for the rest of the year. Um, so two of them, one was grape and one was avocado. And so when you order these, it's random what you get. You do not get to pick the scents that it comes. But I did not know that they were not going to have English on them. Um, like one had grape and one said avocado and I gave them away already. Uh, this one just says hand cream. Uh, and it is in Chinese. And so um, it says O-U-L-I-Q-I. -I. So I guess I could look that up and see what that stands for or if it's a scent. But otherwise it just has the um, Chinese writing on it. Uh, this one says K-N-I-Y-E-A. 
And on the front, it says Sakura, S-A-K-U-R-A, and it's flowery. So I'm assuming that that's kind of a flower print. Like I said, I wanted to give these as gifts. And then this one says hand cream on the front and O-U-L-I-Q-I -I on the back. So it's basically, it says number nine. And this one says number three. So I don't know if I can look that up on the internet and maybe try to find out what number three and number nine smell like. But anyway, the, it was, a, I think, a dollar seventy-nine for five hand creams. It was a really good deal, but I just didn't know that they weren't going to have English on them, which I thought was a little odd, but that's okay. Then I bought this pen that was supposed to go in a Christmas gift, and I've already mailed the Christmas gift off. So anyway, we'll give it to somebody else for Christmas, I guess, or save it for her for her birthday. Sorry about that. Uh, because I hadn't done my haul yet. I tried to record this haul for Timu and somehow some of it didn't come out. So anyway, uh, this pen is really, really cool. So I'll just give it to somebody else. Uh, it has this little stuff on the inside liquid and it has these pretty little flowers in there. I don't know if y'all can see it. And they came in different colors. They had purple, pink, blue, teal, uh, lavender, red, all kinds of different colors. But I just thought that was really pretty, and I'll overlay the price here. I, we had went somewhere to eat, and so a waitress had one like it. She said she got it off of uh, Etsy, I think. But anyway, I found them on Timmy. Thought that they were really cool. We'll overlay that price here. Then I have some stuff I got for myself. Now, I'm going to start wearing this today now that I'm finally hauling it. It is a little Christmas bracelet with a uh, snowman on it. And I thought that this was a snap charm that you could pop off, but it's not. So sometimes they look like snap charms and sometimes they don't. Um, but this one does not pop off. But um, I just wear it through the winter. He looks very Christmassy. But um, I'm going to wear him starting today. And um, so anyway, that's what he looks like. He's so cute with that little snowman on there. Oh, Y'all can see him. And then I bought myself a snap bracelet necklace, and I'm about to order one that is a lanyard that I can put my wear to school every day. And this, these necklaces are so much bigger than I thought they were going to be. <clears throat> but the, the little charm thing on the bottom is so huge. It comes with the chain, this really nice thick chain. And y'all know I love this snap jewelry, but this one was for me and um, whenever I can wear a necklace. But I'm ordering a lanyard that I can put my... Uh, stuff my key and my badge at work and I have it in my cart right now so and then I have another charm that I purchased that's for somebody oh this is the D yeah I think yeah I got the purple charm I thought but anyway I think I've already showed y'all the purple charm anyway this is the D that came off of this snap bracelet um that says it is well with my soul that I wear every day. But anyway, I just wanted y'all to see that that's, that charm goes in the middle. It's kind of crooked, but you can change it. And um, then I can wear it. So I'm going to get me some other snaps to wear. I don't really want to wear the D in the middle. Uh, but I could. could wear the D. Um, that's the only other snap I have right now. But I did. Um, I do have some more sitting in my. Uh, I don't know if I can get it over my necklace. Over my. Uh, entourage that I'm wearing today. <laughs> anyway, that's uh, the snap necklace. And that was my small little Dollar Tree haul. It was um, Timu, excuse me. My small little Timu haul. Um, wait a minute. No, nope, there's one more thing. Sorry. I knew there was something else. I knew I had ordered a charm for somebody else. It's a birthday, a Christmas present or birthday present. One of the two. I don't know. We'll see. I already bought that person a necklace and uh, some charms, but I wanted them to have one more. And so here is the other charm. It is purple, real dark purple charm. And it's one of those snaps. So it'll snap on my necklace. It'll snap on this bracelet. Um, and it'll snap on the purple bracelet that I have. So anyway, that is the snap charm. And I'll overlay the process for these so that you guys can see them. And that is my Timu haul. So I will have another Timu haul and sponsored haul coming up. I'm waiting to, for some campaigns to come through that I want to order something from. So, because all the campaigns so far, I haven't been able to find enough to order. So, anyway, that's neither here nor there. Here's my code in case you want to use it uh, to, for your first order on the app to get a discount. And yeah, that's it. Hope you guys are having a great Christmas week. 
uh, or the week before Christmas, I should say. Next week's Christmas week. And I have to finish decorate the Christmas tree. I need to make some Christmas cookies. I need to make some, we call it Texas trash, but it's like a Chex Mix type thing. We had several people buy us some Chex Mix. I had my Secret Santa, which I want to overlay or show y'all what my Secret Santa gave me because she does watch my channel. And so one of my videos this week, I will do that uh, maybe tomorrow. But my secret Santa was so good this year at school and her name is Tammy and she is one of my subscribers too. She's a friend at school and she also subscribes to my channel. And she gave me some really cool things for Christmas. And one of the things that was my favorite was she made some Chex Mix, some homemade Chex Mix. Uh, we call it Texas Trash. I don't know. What do y'all call it? What do y'all call the homemade Chex Mix? Do y'all have a different name for it? Um, we loved it. My mom and I loved it so much we ate it up. Then one of my subscriber friends locally named Fran came by and she brought some Chex Mix and um, a Christmas card, which I'll show y'all in my friend mail video. Uh, <laughs> and we ate it up and it was so good. So then I go out to the farmer's market, which y'all probably saw that video, and I bought some more and it's gone. So we just went ahead and went to the store and bought the ingredients to make some more. So I don't know if I'll have a chance to do that today, but I will definitely do it tomorrow. And I have Christmas cookies to make and I got to finish, like I said, we have a little bitty tree. Um, we didn't put up a big tree because of our babies who are sleeping so nicely and quietly in front of me right now. Um, they would just tear the tree up so and try to eat it. Uh, so we have one on the table in there and we have one over here where I used to have my craft table. Uh, but I moved all the crafting stuff out for Christmas so we could put our Christmas gifts on that table. And I have a Christmas party that I'm going to tonight. It's a murder mystery. We're having finger foods. I'm baking some little quiches uh, that you just have to put in the oven and bake from Sam's. And I have to, I'm wearing my Christmas dress. And I'm so excited about that. It is my last and only party of the year because I missed the uh, Senior Citizens one. And so I'm very excited about going. And we also have to take a Secret Santa gift to that. Um, so it's going to be a lot of fun, a lot of holiday stuff going on. I hope that you're having a great time. Please keep my friend Danny in your prayers. She had a uh, family member to pass away. Uh, she's one of my best friends. She sometimes gets to watch my channel. Um, she lives out of state. She used to live here, but she lives out of state. She had a family member pass away. And so if you would please say a prayer for Danny, I would appreciate it so very much because I love her and I'm not able to be with her right now because she's out of state. Uh, but we are having some serious prayer time for her uh, because she needs it and her family needs it. So it was very unexpected. Um, so I appreciate those prayers. And uh, just remember everybody that I love you, God loves you, and God bless you. Bye-bye.